I'm here with Dan Mulhern from Veneer Stone and Tom Peterson from Spec Mix. And what we have today, guys, is a great little competition within a competition. We're going to have these two masons lay up some veneer stone using Spec Mix Palmer Modified Stone Veneer Mortar. But first, I want to talk to Dan Mulhern about your veneer stone product. Hey, thanks a lot for having us. Uh, we're really excited to be here today, part of this awesome, awesome competition. You know, veneer stone uh, is a national manufacturer. We're all over the country. Uh, manufacture stone, as you know, is one of the fastest growing siding products in the U.S. You see it everywhere. You guys can't go anywhere. You can't go to a restaurant. You can't go on, on a strip mall without seeing manufacture stone. It's growing in popularity, and these guys are going to show you how easy it is to install today. It's a great product. Everyone in this audience knows about it. You see it every day. I'm excited to be part of it. Thanks. That sounds like a good product. Tom, now you have the Spec Mix Polymer Modified Stone Veneer Mortar. What do you talk about that, please? Absolutely. The, uh, the Spec Mix Polymer Modified Stone Veneer Mortar uh, is a mortar specifically designed, manufactured for installing thin adhered veneer. And so what we're doing today, uh, we're, we're using the product because this is a 15-minute competition for these uh, masons right here. And they need a product that's going to hang the stone uh, fast. Uh, it's not going to sag. Uh, they need something to stick on very well. Uh, and that's the benefits. And, I mean, that's what the, the Spec Mix Palmer Modified Stone Veneer, stone veneer Mortar is. Uh, it, it gives them that ability to do that so fast. Okay. Well, let's go back here and see who our, our, our masons are. I'm over here right now with Jeremy Glenn. He's from Salt Lake City, Utah. You're with Harvin Higgum Masonry. Now, do you guys do a lot of stone veneer installation work? As a company, yes, we do. So you're pretty much, you're ready to go, right? Yes, sir. Did you size up your competition over there? Can you, can you take him down? I hope so. <laughs> let's go over and see who you got over here. All right. Now, you are Jake Brock from Fort Atkinson, Wisconsin, with Brock Construction and Masonry, and you have a, a brother competing over in the event over here? Yes, number nine uh, from Jefferson, Wisconsin, Exteriors Plus Masonry. Yep, We're in it to win it. Five years running, we've been coming back here, so hopefully we'll, we'll knock them down. Now, is this, this type of work new to you, or, or you do it all the time? Yep, we've been doing it for quite a long time. I've been doing it since I was 12 years old, so I'm plenty familiar. No, uh, we'll take down the competition over there. Oh, we got a we got a knock smackdown going here. Okay, now what we have is two different kinds of stone. They can choose from whatever they want to use here, and here's the pa sample panels in front. All right, are you guys ready? Tom, is that mortar ready to go? Now, if they need to, we have a IQ power tool saw here. This is a dustless saw unit, so if they need to make any cuts, they're going to be using this. And I want you to watch, folks. No dust is going to come out of this. Virtually no dust whatsoever. So, Masons, are you ready? All right. Let's start it right now. You guys ready? On your mark, get set, go. Now, the audience, you guys are going to be judging which Mason did the best job. And they're going to win some prizes from Spec Mix, so. Okay. Um, you've been watching these guys build the walls over here. Audience, I need your attention over here because you're going to determine who our big winner is right now as we do this. We have some nice prizes and um, talk to me about this. I, I want to know what you did here and what you thought about everything. Um, I thought it was a very easy stone to lay stacked and a dry stack. It bonded out really nice on the heights and came together pretty easy. I like the, the mortar product was a nice product. Instead of having to do a scratch coat, I was able just to lay, lay, just put it on the back of it and lay it to the block. So I thought it was very nice products, both of them. What about cutting the stone? It was a great saw. I have never used a dustless, and it I mean normally people around here wouldn't be very happy we're cutting stone, and but it seemed like a very good product. It didn't have any dust, and it was nice to work around. All right. Well, the wall looks good. Let's come over here. What do you think about everything? I thought everything worked out good. The mortar is really nice. It doesn't set up too fast. So after. Maybe a minute, if you got to move a stone, you can move the stone, which is important. And then uh, the saw worked out great. Where that would work is um, in a fireplace. If you had a homeowner or a contractor that does a lot of fireplaces, you can bring that thing right in and you can cut indoors. You're not in and out. You're saving a lot of time, a lot of labor. Everything's cost effective. All right, sounds good. All right, studio audience, I need to know. Let's give the T-shirts a break just a second. Focus on right here, guys. I want to know what the best wall is. Let's hear it for contestant number one. <laughs> contestant number two. Well, it's obvious who our winner is. No, it is contestant number one. Let's hear it for him. 
Tom Peterson from Spec Mix. What do we got for a prize over there, guys? We have a $100 gift card to Smith & Walensky, and we've got an authentic Spec Mix Bricklayer 500 jacket for you. Thank you very much. Awesome. Let's give him a nice hand, everybody. Nice job, man. Congratulations. Now, Tom, I know that um, you know we had some of this stone set up, and we have a little demo going on here. Tell us what we got and what you're going to do to show us the strength of this stuff. Well, Tom, we, we, uh, we had a mason install this only a couple of days ago when we were setting up this event. And one of the nice features of the Specmix Palmer Modified Stone Near Mortar is that it d develops a very high bond strength right away. And, and you, you, can d if you, you can actually walk up these stones. No, you're not. Yeah. With a regular Type S mortar, Type N mortar, you couldn't do this. There's no way. So that, that's, that, that's one of the things that's nice. And in, in, when construction's going on, this stuff sticks. That's, that's pretty good right there. That, that's strength. Yeah, absolutely it is. That's awesome. Thank you, Tom Peterson with Spec Mix. Absolutely incredible.